I'm in my uh, homemade uh, ice tank <laughs> outside in Holland and it's summer and it's warm but my legs are very cold at the moment um, yeah this is uh, my uh, post-workout routine here and uh, I jump in the bath with, uh, with real ice from the buckets <laughs> and it's about uh, let me see oh, it's 13 degrees now it will go down a bit because there's a bit of ice in there still and uh, yeah, this is how we ice in Holland. Uh, no uh, pre-made, uh, pre-cooled uh, ice tanks. Uh, we don't have that luxury here. <laughs> but it works the same, so that's good. Um, I did a trek workout. I did uh, 1k and then 2x400, 3x3, 4x2. And I ran with the guys in uh, Seven Hills and it uh, went really well. <laughs> Forty-three. It was kind of a kind of a um, yeah. I say race simulation because uh, it was like uh, the pace I want to run for a K in the fifteen hundred. So that went well, and it really uh, gave me some confidence that I can handle that pace. And um, and then the fours, threes, and twos weren't too fast. And you know that wasn't the hard part of the workout. The K was the most important thing. And then the fours were in like sixty-five, and then threes in between 45 and 47 and the two is like 30 well one was 29 and you know 31 so yeah it was good yeah it was a good workout <laughs> races didn't really go the way I planned them to go, <laughs> I guess. I ran like a, a 204, 205, uh, 800 and a 418, 1500, so those are definitely not the times I wanted to run, but um, in training things are going really well now because I figured out what I was missing and uh, I uh, really got the chance to like work on that these uh, past three weeks. And now I'm 11 days out from my uh, next race and it's going to be in Uden again where I ran uh, my 405 uh, last year and um, yeah hopefully I'll run the qualifier there that'd be nice or uh, yeah maybe even faster maybe PB but um, yeah I'm pretty confident that uh, things are uh, things are gonna be okay <laughs> Probably isn't. This is a seven euro uh, kiddie pool. <laughs> so I think I can get it in other places. But um, yeah, a lot of races actually have ice tanks on the warm up fields, or you can just make an ice tank. There's a spider on your hair. <laughs> okay, it just fell down. You know, living in Australia made me really aware of spiders and uh, how dangerous they can be. <laughs> I used to just pick them up, but I don't anymore because, you know. Some are a bit dangerous, but yeah, but we weren't talking about that. Uh, what were we talking about? <laughs> oh yeah, so I don't really need to take it. Um, lots of times you can just like make an ice bath in the hotel or there's one on the warm up track. So uh, yeah, that's fine. And you know, I like to sit outside here. Sometimes I sit in the sun, but we're a bit late now. But uh, yeah, it's nice to have my uh, little homemade ice tub outside. <laughs> I don't know, you can probably tell a bit of blue. <laughs> Let me see, 5.30, 4.30 to go. <laughs> yeah. 
that's uh that's my old ice tub that's from uh, last year but uh we figured out that you know when i sit sit down like this there's we don't need as much water and so we don't need as much ice so it's uh, easier to uh, get the right temperature but last year i uh i was just sending up straight in that one and uh that worked too but um yeah when my dad got it he uh he wasn't sure about the measurements and uh he called someone over the phone about that thing and then he was like, uh, just tell me how big it is. And the, the person said how many liters it was. And he was like, yeah, I still don't know if, if that's big enough. He's like, does it fit a person? <laughs> so, um, yeah, I think uh, the guy on the line was like, uh, this is a bit strange. I don't know what he, why he wants to put a person in there. But he didn't explain. He just got it. And uh, yeah, but that's, uh, that's 2009. This is 2010. <laughs> Ice top. It's gonna bring big things. <laughs>